Hello, hello, hello! What's happening, everybody? MCOC Droid does back again for another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. Well, it's Sunday, so you know what time it is. It is time for my weekly crystal opening. I've got a fair amount of stuff to open up today. But first, I want to talk about a little something something. So I'm actually recording this Saturday afternoon. It is one, it's about one in the afternoon right now. I was looking at my watch. The reason why I'm recording this and the reason why you're probably noticing that this premiere is much later in the day than normal uh, is because by the time you are seeing this, I will have seen Avengers Endgame. I'm seeing it today, as in Sunday, uh, 11 a.m. my time in IMAX, which is, I'm, I'm like I said, I have not seen it as of right now, but by the time you see this, I will have watched it. Uh, but just the fact that it's Endgame, it's going to be an IMAX. I'm so excited. I'm nervous. I'm I'm happy. I'm sad. I'm I'm pumped. I'm so many emotions. But uh, so because of that, um, I have to. Uh, I'm traveling into the city to go see it, so it's a little bit far away, and I have to leave early-ish in the morning. So I didn't want to try and uh, you know cram in the recording too early or anything. So. I'm recording this on Saturday afternoon. I know there'd be more stuff I can pick up in terms of arena and rank rewards and all that, but it's okay. That'll just start going towards next week's uh, weekly opening. So real quick for those of you who are watching this on the premiere, again, this will it'll be whenever pretty much I can get home and get it scheduled, but I should have already said it in the chat by now. I've kind of had this extended intro for a reason. Um, again, I have seen it, and a number of people will have seen it by the time this video goes live, of course, but please, no spoilers in the chat. If you're watching this on demand, please do not post any spoilers. Again, I will have seen it, so I will keep an eye out in the comment section and get rid of any spoilers just in case, but please do not. Hashtag don't spoil the endgame has been going around for a while, so please don't be that person and ruin it for somebody else. Please go. Uh, just consider everybody else and, and don't post any spoilers. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into this. So, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry. So, actually, as you can see, I have a bunch of five-star shards. And I, unless some weird thing happens, I should be able to have five four-stars in this, in this opening, um, in addition to everything else. And I should be able to go over 20,000. So, as soon as I'm done recording this... I'm going to be recording a double five-star opening that will be going up probably tomorrow morning, like Monday morning. So uh, be on the lookout for that as well. But as always, let's begin at the beginning. Like I said, I have so many crystals to open. It's been a very busy week. Um, let's just get these daily crystals out of the way because you all know they are terrible for me. And there you go. They are very terrible for me. No units, no four-stars, no tier two alpha frags. What else is new? Uh, do I have any fully formed basics or premiums? I should say yes, I do. I have six of them. So let me. Um, I'm just gonna actually smash these open because, like I said, there's there's a lot to do today, um, and, and that's not even including five or six stars. So those are all two stars and nothing exciting. Um, speaking of, I did post a five and six star opening. It was my round eleven of Hunt for Aegon. Um, and the, the dupe that I got from there, that's the only spoiler I will do, gave me enough six-star shards to open a six-star basic, so I did that in that video as well. Be sure to check that out. That is popping in the corner right now. Um, let me open up these two-star crystals. So, a lot of extra crystals had come in this past week from a number of things. I mean, a new event quest started. Uh, the bounties have been uh, moving along. You know, there's still about another week or so left of those. Um, they introduced the objectives into the game, and there have been so many of these summoner's journey objectives, you know, just like the normal ones that are permanent, they don't go anywhere, but twice they've sent out quote-unquote compensation for those of us who are kind of ahead of most of the objectives, they just basically, you know, skipped ahead for us and gave us the rewards for them, and there, that's where those two-star crystals came from. There's, like I said, there's just been so many shards and things like that. I have these Grandmaster Endgame crystals to open, which we'll get to in a few minutes. Just so much this past week. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I actually have a fair amount of stuff to open. And, uh, Virgil, as you can see, I've been doing a fair amount of arena, hence all of the shards as well for premiums. So, you should be very proud of me, I would think. <laughs> 
And again, I'll probably still get a little bit more arena in before it expires, but just like I said, I wanted to record this video nice and early. So I'll spin out one of these just for the heck of it. Um, still looking for a Dark Hawk. Three, I mean, four star would be cool, but three star even would be great. I don't have him at all. So to add him to the roster would be nice. Thing just got added to the crystals earlier this week as well. Um, who I did not pull. That is just a two-star Magneto. Uh, but yeah, so he got into the crystals as well. I have him as a three-star, but that's it. So, uh, I mean, I definitely would not mind pulling him as a four-star, as a five-star. So uh, who knows? We shall see. But let me go ahead and do this stack of ten premiums right here. Uh, no new, so no Darkhawk and no four-star thing. In addition to others, of course. But uh, let's see. Anything exciting? Got one three-star. Just a one three-star. Wow. Um, I mean, again, that's fine. We'll save the luck. Again, I know that I'm pretty much recording the double five-star opening right after this. So we can save the luck for that. That is absolutely fine. Uh, next stack of ten. Let's go ahead and get those going. Uh, still no new. I see one three-star in the window. Anything else? Wow. Yeah, another stack of ten. Another almost shutout, basically. Yeah, I'm definitely, uh, I'm not even, I'm not even with the odds right now. So, I will not be buying that either. I am starting to save up units, though. Um, if y'all missed it, I did do a plan of, of, like, rank-ups and questing, like, what order of operations, basically, I want to do, and I'm putting off... Um, the first full run of 6.1 until I have more units so I can pick up that offer. So getting closer to that at least, a nice little bump, but obviously I've got quite a ways to go. Uh, let me see if I can just do a stack of the max... Well, I've got this one fully formed three stars. Let's open that right quick. That's another dupe. That's fine. Uh, but I was just going to open up a couple of... Uh, or I guess a stack of ten or however many I have of the max sig crystals just to do... One more three-star pull. I've got 32 of them, so... Stack of 10 works. That's plenty. Get on out of that. Back over here. Um, there we go. So I've got nine three-stars to open. If the graphics would keep up. That's kind of weird. Alright. Let's convert the other two. Hopefully you all had a good week as well. Like I said, I mean, it's all... It's just about endgame, you know? It's... I'm so excited to see it. I know a lot of you have... Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just really excited. Uh, big month here in the game, of course. So let's open up this deck of nine. One new would be cool. That would mean Darkhawk, but, uh, let's see. And no new. All right, that's fine. So let's just convert all these. Most of them will be max sig. Um, I am getting pretty darn close to the 1 million rating. Uh, let's see how I'm doing right now. I'm about 13,000 points or so away, something like that. Uh, let's take a look super quick. 17,000, excuse me. I'm at 983 and change. So when I hit the million, I'll do an updated roster video. It's been a long time since I've done one of those. Um, okay, so I am just shy of a fifth four-star. But let's do some Grandmaster stuff first. Let's let Let's see if I can get some luck. So this is just the normal login one. Um, I'll let it spin for a couple of seconds. And I already saw Thing in the Reels. That's pretty cool. Like I said, a four or five star Thing would be on. Awesome. Five star Thing would be amazing. That five star Aegon is such a tease. Come on, Kabam. Uh, but of course, yeah, three star. That's all I tend to expect from these, which is totally fine. Um, was that enough? I forget what my math. <laughs> I, one more three star dupe. That's 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 fine. That'll get me there. Um, so let's go over to these special Grandmaster ones. So. Yesterday, when I'm filming this, so this it would have been on Friday. It would have been on Friday. Um, they had some unit deals where they added some items uh, to the unit packs based on what part of the game you're in. They had some of these end game crystals and then either five star shards or six star shards. Um, I wanted to get more, but I, I ran out of iTunes, unfortunately. If I knew they were coming, I definitely would have saved and gotten more. But. Uh, um, I got like the $5 and the $30 one. Um, so these are the Grandmaster Crystals, the standard ones. Um, where are the... Oh, well, they had the drop rates. Um, I feel like... They, they did have the drop rates when they were offered in the packages. So maybe if I open them up. Basically, I'm not going to read all these out. But it's your standard Grandmaster Crystals. So you're guaranteed a 3-star with a shot at a 4 or 5-star. If any of those champs, it's a pretty big list as you can see right there but essentially anyone involved in avengers infinity war or endgame movies um uh some of my alliance members have done okay with these i saw one person earlier today isn't saturday 
um, you know, picked him up before they went away and got a five star Doctor Strange, which would be really cool. Um, I still want a five star Doctor Strange. He's quite rare. So let's spin these out. Let's see if I can get any luck. Again, it's only four, so I was like, I could do a separate video, but now nah, just I'll just do it in, in the uh, the weekly opening. Make this opening hopefully a little bit spicier. Oh, that five star Drax would have been cool. I mean, it would have been like a fourth dupe or something, but still would have been a five star, so that would have been okay by me. Um, moving right along, uh, I mean, again, you see you see the champs in the reel here. I mean, Fury is in here, so a four or five star Nick Fury would be awesome. Uh, that he just went by right there. A uh, five star Ghost, which again, I'm not really sure why she's in these crystals, but I guess because she's an Ant Man and the Wasp. I don't know. Um, hopefully that's not a spoiler, because again, I have not seen the movie yet. Uh, crystal number two, just a Drax, whatever. Uh, five star Black Widow would also be part of the mix. She is rare, as of course, so that would be a, a cool one to pull. I think uh, five star Thor should also be available then. So, he, you know, he just recently got, quote unquote, introduced into the game with Grandmaster Crystals about a week or so ago. Yeah, there's <laughs> there's both of them. <gasps> Stop! No! <laughs> That's so mean. Why do they troll me? They always troll me. That should have stopped there. That should have been a normal. That wouldn't have even been a hard stop. That would have been a normal stop. And it should have happened. That's so mean. <sighs> oh, hooray. I completed that objective. A three-star Avenger. Not what I was looking for. And then don't, don't, don't fret. I saw the five-star ghost that was right after that three-star. That's so mean. Oh, come on, Kabam. Make it, make it up to me on this crystal right here then. Please. Um, hey, pff, another rollover. God forbid I actually get a four star out of four of these crystals. No, instead I get all three stars because Kabam, in the grand scheme of things, Kabam does hate me. If you follow my channel for a while, it'd be pretty hard to argue otherwise. But yeah, Kabam hates me. Um, God, that was brutal. That was so brutal. And there was a five star Heimdall. He's on my list. He is on my list of new champs that I want to pull. I'd love to be able to use that synergy. Um, you know, in 6.1, but apparently not. Um, I'm just going to pop this. This is the Red Skull login crystal we got earlier this week. I'm expecting a three star. It's exactly what I get. Still have never pulled a four, uh, four star from a login crystal. So that's, you know, never going to happen. Um, my hopes are certainly not up for something like that. But uh, let's hope we can turn around a little bit uh, with these final five. So to recap, I need 1,800 five star shards in order to get to 20,000. So obviously I would love at least a few max sig dupes in here which are which are pretty possible for me. I'm at like 65, 66 four stars that are at sig level 99. So you all know the max sig crystals do come pretty quickly for me. So let's see what this first one is going to be and it is uh <laughs> Like I said, the Max Sig crystals come so frequently, but hey, I finally pulled a four-star Sentinel. That's it's been a long time coming, obviously, but uh, yeah, finally got them. So that's kind of cool. I don't think I have a four-star Tech Gem, but uh, you know, nice to have them at least. Um, again, Dark Hawk would be a new champ, which I still would not mind to get. Um, still would like to test that synergy he has with Moon Knight, since I have Moon Knight as a six-star now. Hooray! And a crystal number two. Okay, so that is a dupe. Um, I also can't remember what he's at. And okay, good. I in the back of my mind, I thought he was Max Sig, but I didn't want to assume. So that's good. That 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 quote unquote makes up for the new Sentinel at least. So that's most likely two dupes right there, getting the t extra 275 shards from the five star Max Sig crystal. Let's take a look at four star number three. Let's see what it's going to be. Uh, Taskmaster is a dupe. I'm pretty certain he's not Max Sig, though. Um, okay, no, he's getting there. He's getting there. I don't know if I have that many uh, skill stones around, but getting close to Max Sig, so not bad. Uh, but it's a dupe, so that makes me happy. Like I said, that that is what I'm looking for right now. I just want the dupes. Just give me the dupes. Uh, crystal number four right here. Let's see what it's going to be. Uh, Sabretooth. Okay, so that is a dupe. He's not Max Sig, though, right? 
So I didn't think so. I'm like, he's he's too new. There's no way I already have him at SIG level 99. So, but that's fine. It's another dupe. We're 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 on par here since that's three dupes, one max sig crystal. So if this could be another max sig dupe, that would be nice. That would that would make me feel a little better, actually. God, I'm still I'm still burning over that five star Heimdall troll over. Come on, Kabam. Come on. Anyway, let's see what this last one's going to be. And it is Beard. Oh, Corvus. All right. Beardo would have. Or Beardo. Cap would have been better because that is a max sig dupe. Corvus is not, as you can see. So, um, still not bad. Uh, you know, got the new champ, so that's nice. I'm absolutely not buying that upgrade. So, come on. Get that out of here, Kabam. Um, got the 1100 charts. So, I am close. I am definitely close. Um, I don't think I have any other max sig crystals that I'm hanging on to right now. I think I've. Opened them already? Let's take a look. Yeah, just the one. So, this obviously is not enough. Um, we just started a bounty mission right before uh, we got this started. So, that will be another 325 shards, which will put me very close to the next one. Um, how am I on four stars? That's not enough. I was going to look at max sig crystals over there to see if I could like do another four star pull. But, yeah, that's not going to be enough, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have anything else I can open right now that would get me some five-star shards on the quick. So, uh, yeah, got a tiny bit of work to do. Like I said, bounty mission and stuff like that. So, unfortunately, not a double opening ready just yet, but very, very soon. In terms of the weekly opening, though, that will wrap it up. So, thank you, everybody, for watching. If you're here watching with me on the premiere, I appreciate it. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, for those of you catching on demand, as always, in the comments below, how has your week been? Uh, did you get any spicy, juicy polls? Or, like me, did you get another one of those dreaded kabam trollovers that I'm going to go cry myself to sleep over? <laughs> if you're not already a subscriber, uh, feel free to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to ring the bell so you get notified for new content. Everybody hit that like button. Three buttons in a row. That really helped me out, and I greatly appreciate it. Aside from that, thank you for watching, take care, and I will see you next time.